fam, welcome back guys Welcome back to another series, alright Today we'll be playing market uh, I don't know if I pronounce it correctly <laughs> Market mark I don't know Alright, it's supposed to be a PS5 exclusive And it's free this month on the PSN, alright it's, I mean on the P uh, PlayStation Plus So if you are a member, okay, just grab it right now, alright It's very interesting, it's basically it's about a game that focus heavily on scale and perspective all right imagine these two things you add it together you put some spice you add some salt some pepper you know put the lamb sauce <laughs> that is what market is all right so it's a very heavily focused on puzzle yeah okay so let's see what the game has to offer for us all right i have to be honest i actually tried it out for a little bit and apparently there is some uh copyright claim on the music part so unfortunately we have to turn it off and i'm fine with that because if you guys follow me on this channel you know that usually when you play games especially for me i like to off the music all right so that is more immersive i mean in the real life if you imagine you are inside there's no music am i right you know so let's just double check okay music is off all right let's go guys okay i will just quickly glance through this part because there's really nothing much Okay, I lost my keys last night, so I turned everything inside out, trying to find them, okay. Basically, it's just a very minimal story, background, but with, don't add anything much, I will have to say that, you know. In my search, I came across a box that was long overdue to be opened. Mm -hmm. I mean, at the core of it, this game supposed to be a PS5 games, but my honest opinion is that it doesn't look next gen. You get what I mean? It doesn't look next gen. The frame, the frame, I don't know. It does not look like it's a steady 60 FPS. Definitely not. Forgotten objects from our life together, a graveyard of... Yeah, so... It's a very small game actually. The file size I believe is 2 point something gig for the download size. I, I'm not sure after the installation is how much but yeah that's what it's shown on the PlayStation Store yeah. Matures from that fancy place with the noodles you like. Some more records we picked up on our Sunday trip store trips. Novelty glasses I broke when I was too drunk at the New Year's party and painted on the roof and you calmed me down. Yeah, essentially it's a... Uh, we are following a journey of a couple, alright? Yeah, one thing I realized is that every time there is new text coming out, we will go into this frame deep. Alright, if you understand the term, frame dipped or uh, it will went into it will go into one FPS for a millisecond. Alright, then the frame you, you see that's that <laughs> it just strengthened my point right there. A toy block from that hilarious, disastrous weekend we tried babysitting your nephew. You see what I mean? Every time there's text come out, the frame always drop. Uh, in between a handmade birthday card, a filthy guitar pick, Monopoly houses. I mean, it's not really showing the hardware of the next gen or, you know, it's just making it look bad. But in terms of gameplay, I have to say that it's really not bad. I tried it out for a little bit, it's, it's really not bad. Okay, so this part I already know what is going on. Basically the key is over here. Yeah, the puzzle will be slowly getting from easy to less easy to normal and to hard. You get what I mean? <laughs> Alright. Yeah, 
Yeah, it's actually a very mysterious place. We are not very sure what... We are not 100% sure what is going on. And even what we are doing here in the first place. But... I guess we'll find out together. I just couldn't stop turning the pages and looking at what our past self were capable of imagining. Okay, if you guys don't know, I'm uh, I used to be a designer. All right. Uh, yeah. So perspective is very big words for us. <laughs> you get what I mean. So hopefully I don't suck at this game. Hopefully I don't suck hard at this game. Yeah, so basically we are inside the castle or the dome, inside a bigger dome, you see. And outside this bigger dome, there is another bigger dome. I don't know how many layers are there, <laughs> but that's basically the theory, you know. I mean, the game didn't do much marketing on itself and, and not much explanation being shown, so... The sketchbook opened right to the drawing we made the day we first met at that coffee shop. Uh, hey, sorry. Um, do you mind if I sit here while I wait for my coffee? Oh, uh, yeah, knock yourself out. Oh, God. oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> no, don't worry, it only spoke I'm a little. I'm such a klutz. Oh. <laughs> Is your sketchbook okay? Um, yeah, unscathed. It's, uh, it's just doodles anyway. Can I see it? Oh, um... Oh, this is a cool castle! <laughs> Thanks. I, uh, I just started drawing again. I used to sketch constantly and then, I don't know, I just stopped. So did I. I mean, there was a time in elementary school when I was the girl who was good at drawing. The girl who was good at drawing? I remember that girl. Everyone was always like, Oh, please, will you help me with my poster? How do I draw hands? Exactly. <laughs> I was like... I don't know how to draw hands. I'm five years old. <laughs> well, let's see how far you've come since your toddler years. <laughs> okay. Um, you're drawing in an upside down. Hey, there is no right or wrong way to draw in a sketchbook. <laughs> okay, that's fair. Oh, uh, wow, that's my order. That was fast. Um, I'm Kenzie, by the way. I'm Michael. It's nice to meet you. I just gotta run. Bye, Kenzie. Alright, so what happened right there is basically to give us a small background of who we are and who we were talking to, right? So, we are Michael and the girl, at least as of this point, she's not our girlfriend or anything like that, you know? It's just like we are hitting off in a cafe or, I mean, it's a coffee shop and we were trying to hit on her or something. <laughs> so, her name is Kenzie, right? Every date was romantic. I don't think we ever did the boring old get drinks in a bar routine. Okay. Right. Let's go. Okay. So, yeah, you see there is the bigger box out there and then this smaller box in here and then the smallest box in here and then the small small smallest box in there <laughs> that is what i mean by we're inside of the outside of the outsiders if you get my english all right <laughs> okay so i think we're supposed to bring this out so we can access this plot this plot this part all right you, you remember just now there's a box here now it's gone yeah that's how the game works Whatever is happening on the smaller version is gonna ha be happening on the bigger version. That's that's basically it, alright? So you have to keep that in mind and try to solve the puzzle. We spend afternoons drawing together on Backyard Pasio in the Mission Districts. Okay, so now we need to find a way to cross the bridge. Right? Wait, am I right? Uh, I think so. I mean, 
<laughs> I don't know. I think so. Uh, what do we have? All right. What do we have here? We need to find a way to cross the bridge. Um. All we have right now is the. Eh. Yeah, all we have right now is the the box itself. So, what do we have? Nothing. What if I go down? Can can I? Will I be able to come back up? But I don't see any staircase. That's the problem. Hold on. Let's take a closer look, yeah. No, I don't think we can come back up if we fell down because do you see it's being blocked, isn't it? Um, let's see. Oh. Anything here? Nope. Alright, just gonna make a leap of faith. See what is gonna happen. <laughs> I don't know. Probably I'll be stuck. Oh no. We are? Are we stuck? Oh no. We found something. Oh, a bridge. A bridge. Alright. See? A leap of faith, guys. Have faith in me, you know? Let's go. Okay, I think I know where to put this already. Since it's a smaller version, we're gonna bring it to the smaller side. <laughs> uh, L2 is to move in, R2 is to move out. Okay, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, is it is it in position? I think so. Okay, good. Let's go. See? This is why man. Wait. There's only one way to find out. You know, everything is very magical. Alright, if you're wondering. How does it fare on the DualSense controller? Uh, I'm gonna be honest, alright. Uh, basically, there's nothing much. At least at this point, there's nothing much that I can feel from the DualSense itself, right? Uh, all I can sense so far is just the trigger having a res resistance to it. Only the adaptive trigger, alright? The haptic feedback, nothing much. And even the trigger itself is just... Pure resistant, alright? Pure resistant. I mean, it can compare to, it can't compare to COD, Cold War, or, you know, Astro Playroom. If you have a PS5, you understand. Astro Playroom is basically the standard. As of date, as of today, not a single game can compare to Astro Playroom when it comes to the DS5 controller itself, you know? You get what I mean? Yeah, that's basically it. It's, it's really... Uh, it's blocked. It's basically nothing much happening on the dual sense itself. It's nothing major. There's something in it, but really nothing major if, you, if you're if wondering about it. We have this thing that looks like... What is this? A armor plate or something? Doesn't make sense. <laughs> Alright, so we cleared the second door. Yeah? Alright, let's see which is the third door. There's one there. Okay, this one is looking for a key. I don't think that metal piece... Okay, if that doesn't fit this key, means it's for this door, isn't it? What is this? 
A little box? Huh? So where does this piece fit? Here? Oh! Oh! Okay, I think it's here. What? Huh? It... It looks the same, isn't it? It looks the same as the picture, you see? But... It's not working. Oh! <laughs> I get it, I get it. Uh, but how do I do this? Hold on, hold on. I need to think. I need to think. Do you get why I'm getting it? It's the same item, just that it's not on the same scale. You get what I mean? Here we go. Yes, we're supposed to get the smaller scale one, I think. Am I right? Yes. <laughs> oh, this game is fun, man. I mean, the technical part is not much, but the gameplay is fun, you know? Oh, I smell it. Now this takes me back. Welcome to the fair. Not how I pictured it. What did you imagine? You saw my drawing, you know, circus tents and stuff. Well, a county fair is nothing like circus. No, but I don't know. I just kind of assumed. Hold on, your parents never took you to the fair? No, we went to Disneyland. Oh, you are gonna have to set your bar a thousand times lower. Think like, like a farm, but with a lot more deep fried stuff and tube tops and twenty dollar beers. Will they at least have a Ferris wheel? Okay, yeah, that is the one thing you sketched that we probably will see here. But it won't look like the janky one you drew. <laughs> really? No, it will be even jankier. I mean, these rides, they're death traps, and, and that's all part of the thrill. <laughs> Tube tops, $20 beers, and death traps? That's setting the bar plenty high for me. Right. So, what do we do here? Seems like we had a fair or something. Yep. Alright. If you guys see on your screens, the frame looks kind of low and stuttering around here and there, right? That is exactly what I'm seeing as well, right? If you're wondering, is just the video quality or the game itself? It's the game itself, alright? I just have to be sure right? that it's the game itself. It's not running like a next gen game, honestly. It doesn't look like a next gen game, yeah? And it doesn't run like it. Alright? I have to be honest. Okay, so let's try to find what we're supposed to do next. Okay, for all we know, we're supposed to, uh, to find the key for this, right? Yeah, this is the last door, I believe. Yeah, it's the last door. So we need to find a key for that in here somewhere or we trigger something to find a key out i don't know Wait, is it on the fairy well and i am um, um, can i what what <laughs> <laughs> we all right we managed to glitch inside the the fairy veil the the steps go inside the wall wall hack yo <laughs> joe are you seeing this every single game also break guys <laughs> joe you watching this comment below all right i hope that you see this scene man all right let's get on guys now i'm not sure if i can get out since we're already glitching. Can I get out? No. Oh no, now I'm stuck. Oh. <laughs> oh, we're back. How? But how? Oh my god, do I have to? Oh, okay, okay. I was thinking probably I have to reload the game, but it's alright. There were things we both secretly wanted, but thought were too strange or cheesy to articulate but with you everything was easy what is that behind the wall 
Let, let, let's take a look. No, I can't jump. Can I glitch through the wall again? Oh no, I'm stuck again. Oh my god. Why? <laughs> I'm not even kidding, I'm stuck. Okay, okay, at least we are up now. No! Okay, okay, we are out, we are out. Come, I want to see what is behind this wall. Can we, can we jump across? Let, 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 let's try, let's try, let's try. No, 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 no. You know what? You know what? Let's go and look at the other side. Yeah? <laughs> See? Oh, it's a machine or something. Oh, oh, it's a trap door, I think. It's a gate or something. It looks like there's a switch. Can, can, can we do it? Easy. Let's go, guys. Where is it again? This way. Are the key is here somewhere, I think. No, there's no key. What is that? A gem, a quartz, a pearl, something. Oh, you want to try this fortune telling machine? Mm, I don't know. What? You don't like these? I'm not superstitious, but. If I get a bad fortune, I feel like it's some kind of doomed, self-fulfilling prophecy. These things don't give bad fortunes. Not necessarily. When I was a kid, one of those things told me my pet turtle Pinky would die. And she did. Well, unfortunately, that is part of the turtle life cycle. They do die. It was a Galapagos turtle. <laughs> no, it wasn't. No, but she did die a few days later. Okay, we don't have to do it. No, 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 no. Just because I don't want to do it doesn't mean you shouldn't. Go for it. Okay. Hmm. What does it say? Um, nothing. Michael? I, I guess they do give bad fortune sometimes. Huh. Yeah, you were right. So did he get a, a bad fortune? Oh, there it is, the key. Very convenient, isn't it? We just drop right there. <laughs> What's this? We first held hands on the ferry wheel, which might have been corny. Yeah, but it was windy and the uh, the what shook, and we held each other close. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go, guys. <coughs> What? Oh. Wait, are we? Hold on. Are we already at the end of the game? There is four gates and we already opened up the final gate. It's very short, isn't it? I don't know if I'm... Oh, oh, this part I know. This part I know for sure. <laughs> you know why? Because I seen this uh, footage from the state of play or sometimes where when they were showcasing the PS5 game I think they're supposed to drop it here yep and now we have a bridge to cut across see? easy and here it is wow this place is great isn't it? What do you call it? Just the secret spot, I guess. I've walked past here a million times. I never knew this was here. I don't think anyone does. Wow, you can see the street from here. Yeah. <laughs> they have no idea we're up here. You do know Why what the like secret me? means, right? Oh, come on. You don't think anyone knows about this? No, I put that little guardian owl in there. Oh, so he keeps it safe? No, dude, he's made of wood. I just think he'd be gone or vandalized if anyone else had been here. I really think I'm the only one who knows. Well, now two people know. I've never shown this place to anyone, Michael. You're the first. I won't tell anyone. Promise? Pinky promise. Actually, that is a very smart move right there, you know? Whatever she was saying. She leave the hour there, this wooden hour there, right? So, it's to confirm next time that she come back, uh, it will it will let her know whether people had come here before or not. Because 
people might vandalize it or move it around or, or somehow you know when there's human there's a butterfly effect so that certain thing will change you know in the in the space if you get what i mean wait what wait but it doesn't allow us to go anywhere huh i confused so what now Oh. Okay, I need to run to work. You've got the address for tonight? Yeah. When should I get there? Well, my roommates are kicking things off at 7. But my shift isn't done till 9. But if Aaron shows up, I can get out at... So... What time should I get there? Get there when you get there. If I'm not there, just introduce yourself. Great. I'll see you then. So, I'm guessing we are going to the girl's house? Or something? Oh, okay. Wait, does this mean that's the end of the game? Since we already found the girl's house, isn't it? <laughs> and then, one thing or another later, a baby pop out, I don't know. Okay, now we have to get to here. So, we're supposed to take the key, isn't it? Take the key and then we swap it here. Oh, easy. I'm the master at this, guys. Let's go. Hello. Hello. How do I knock? Oh. Oh, shit. I thought I was. Um, I, I think I'm supposed to find another key. Is it? Yeah, it's shining. It's, it's, we're supposed to find another key. Can I use this key? Oh no, it's too heavy. <laughs> oh, oh. I think this is the correct size. I'm alright. But then, if we take this key, isn't the bridge moving as well? Yeah, the bridge is taken away. So, how can we... Unlocked that door without moving the bridge. What? Because uh, this is the correct size for the door that I'm looking at right now. You see this door that I'm looking at, pointing at right now. But if we bring this key, that key will have to go all the way there as well. So we don't have any more bridge because the small, the medium, and the big will move. Simultaneously. Oh! Wait. Oh! Oh, eh? Wait. Where did... I... What if... Oh, I can't. I can't take it. Wait, 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 wait for it, guys. Yes, we can take it now. What if I do this? Does it work? <laughs> I'm a genius, guys! <laughs> okay, we get it. Alright, now we will have to... Bring back the bridge. Um, how do I do that again? Oh no, it's stuck. What's happening? Where's my key? Okay, okay, okay. Um, how do I do this? We bring the key back in. Right. So. Where's the key? Oh, is there? Alright. So that's one layer of enlargement. Now we will try to enlarge it one more time. Isn't it? By bringing it, bringing it into this one. Ah, okay. Done. Easy. Let's go. How long have you been here? I was just about to ask you the same. Who are you talking to? Uh, one of your friends, tall, pale, heavy eyeliner. Guy or girl? Girl. Oh, Anne. She's not my friend friend. She's a friend of a friend. 
but still a friend. Oh yeah, love her, but I want to introduce you to my really close friends. Well, Anne gave me a whirlwind tour of introductions already. Oh? Yeah, and they all knew who I was. Oh. Yeah, I am um, quote unquote Kenzie's bestie. Your roommate Tom actually insisted that I have been your co-worker for two years. Oh my god, Michael, I'm I, I'm so sorry. That's so embarrassing. Kenzie, I, I am not good with Can can we go somewhere to talk? Yeah, my, my room's down here. You know, I'm I'm not good with things like making moves or whatever, but I didn't think that we're not just friends, are we? Michael, look, I'm not good with making moves either. I mean, I'm way better than you, but these last couple weeks, honestly, I feel like I'm in a dream pretty much the entire time that I'm around you. And no, we're not just friends. Our first year together was epic. It would be easy to talk that up to naive hopes, naive hopes, or claim it felt that way simply because it was new. But even today, I feel what we had back then was special. All right. So what's next? <coughs> what? What is this? Huh? We are being transported into a different place. No, it's not. It's still, it's still the same dome. It's still the same. I, I just call it a dome. Uh, I don't know if there is any technical term they are calling it. Right? No, just call it the central plaza. Right? Central. <laughs> Let's call it the plaza from now on. Right? So now we are in the desert or something. How do we get out of here? Alright guys, that's nice, it's around 30 minutes, a sweet spot to take a break from this. <laughs> I will see you on this one, alright? Uh, so far, is the gameplay itself, alright? Uh, just the gameplay itself is very fun, it's very unique. Yeah, I know that there is some game that take a concept of this, and but in a different way, you know? It's not exactly as this game, what it does, but... In terms of graphical and technical parts, I don't think it's really for the next gen, alright? Uh, as much as they want to call it exclusive on the PS5 and so on, or whatever it is, it's not, it's not really a good title to showcase what the PS5 is capable of, alright? If you ask me 1 to 10, this game, use this game to show what is PS5 is capable of, this is literally 1, alright? It's nothing close to what the PS5 is capable of. Yeah? The frame rate is inconsistent. It's inconsistent. And the DS5, the DualSense 5, doesn't feel anything. You know? It's just pure resistance. That's all. Alright? But in terms of gameplay, I'm very excited to continue with this series. And I hope you guys feel the same way. Alright? If you want to see the next one, make sure you're on the notification bell so that... The next one coming out soon in a few hours, I hope. <laughs> Alright, so that I won't have to keep you guys very long. Alright, with that, I will see you on the next one. Bye.